Hey, it's Soleil, and I guess this is episode 174. Uh, dot one. I forgot to come back and look at these um, these long calls. I think I do want to deal with these. I don't like having these long calls, certainly not under 90 days. As an option seller, I would never sell in any scenario that I can imagine for now. There's some, there's some weird, there's some weird spreads that some people do. Um, but I, I definitely don't sell any options past 60 days. I generally, the sweet spot, according to Tasty Trades research is around 45. So as an option buyer, if I know that the seller's advantage is under 90 days, then I don't want to be owning any of these long calls under 90 days. So this is at 125 days. This is starting to make me a little nervous. Um, the value is going to start collapsing more and more. So I'm, I'm just going to close these. I am taking a loss on both of these bad boys. Of about 50% haircut, which is fine. I'm going to redeploy this capital farther out. Um, I took a look. So these December 2025 ones that I was looking at, the cheapest ones all the way at the bottom of the chain. Excuse me. I think this is the top of the chain. Um, depending on how you're looking at it, it's about 23 grand. So I just sold five grand worth of options. And if I get rid of all six of these, I'm probably going to have to yeah, roll that down a little bit. All right, got rid of those. That's another 30 grand. And then I've got two of these. See, these are 224 days out. And I just opened these. Let's dump them because I'm going to end up with, uh, well, let's just buy these first. Let's see how much they cost me. If I get one, yeah, see, that's the other thing is I was going to split these up between two accounts. So I, was, I wanted to get two. Um, what's the delta on this? The delta is going to be about 0.37. Yeah, let's grab two of these. I figured I would just make this. I, I did. I have forgot to go back to it, and I, I could take screenshots and post them below, but. Um, all right, where is that? There it is. I have to pay a little bit more. All right. So that is about 73 Delta. So yeah, let me just close these. Get some more of this buying power back. Let's try to collect. 7180. Nope. Uh, let's walk it down. Try to collect 7095. Nope. Let's try to collect. What did I just try to collect? 7095. Oh, okay. They filled. Super. So now I just have these two. Now these are officially leaps. They're over three. <laughs> they're over a year old, and so the um, 
the theta on these is going to be really low. I'm only going to be, let's just go over here. So MicroStrategy, where'd I go? December. Yep. Theta on this is 57 cents a day, but compared to the price is nothing compared to if we look at something at 45 days. Well, that's kind of not fair because it was only the 2800 strike. Where can I go and get 3800s? There we go. So out 120 days, theta on here is 51 cents a day. But <laughs> that amount of theta is draining out of this much, much tinier contract. So this sucker is going to go broke very quickly. So it's worth 2,500 now, but in just one month earlier, this will probably get cut in half. So it's value, yeah, it's value goes from 2,500 to 1,200. So theta is way more damaging closer to, to expiration. So when I'm buying something, I want to go out as far as I can possibly stand it. But at the same time, no farther than I have to, because you're just going to be paying for no reason. Um, I will not be carrying any leverage past 2025. So no margin uh, in MicroStrategy, no margin, no long calls, um, <laughs> no loans. Uh, disclaimer, I've, I've borrowed like, I don't know, 100,000 signature loans and, and whatnot to uh to purchase micro strategy with so to say that i'm irresponsibly long is an understatement definitely not financial advice but um and that's one reason why people say oh well why would you why would you limit your upside well in order to make the payments on these loans i gotta sell some <laughs> i gotta sell some premium and collect yield um, but generally it costs me about one week of premium to pay the loans off and so then the the, the profits from weeks two, three, and four per month are all are all just gravy uh, that I can use to to buy more shares and more leaps and and all that good shit. So, all right, be good again, y'all.